I'm reading comments on Instagram, on Quora, and on YouTube over here. I'm reading these comments which says physics is difficult. I'm getting to read that physics mein numericals nahi samajh mein aa raha hai, ye concepts nahi samajh mein aa raha etc. My question is, you've taken science after getting some good percentage in 10th because you have a goal, because you have a need, and because you have a want to become something in the science field. Isn't that right? Now, while taking the science, didn't you research this well that there needs to be a certain kind of commitment that is needed from your part, a certain kind of love towards the subject, certain kind of curiosity which is needed and above all the determination and the practice that is needed to work so hard on the subject, to practice it regularly, to read the concepts and to get it right. Imagine a time that you know the concepts. Imagine a time that you understand everything of that particular chapter. Now tell me, agar iske upar se kuch bhi sawal puchu, is it still going to be difficult? It's not, right? The reason why you say it is difficult is because you have not understood the concept. Now you can't blame anybody for this other than yourself. You have either bunked certain things in between or you've lost the continuity in between or you've taken it too lightly. Physics needs some kind of an assurance, it needs some kind of a commitment and it needs a determination of regular practice and bow all understanding the concept very well. Did you understand the concept? Number one. Number two, did you practice it well? Number three, are you solving these MCQs on a daily basis? If you're not doing these three things, then you're just cheating yourself. You're just procrastinating it and you're keeping it every day certain things behind lagging behind thinking that someday magic will happen or someday you'll begin to solve and someday things will change but that someday is not going to come unless you decide to make this day as that someday and begin to work on it so find the teacher the mentor or somebody like that to whom you can go and sit and say ye nahi samjha please samjhao i need explanation in this concept please samjhao you must be able to find that mentor who will handhold you who will guide you and take you through your physics journey once you understand the concept remember without understanding the concept there is no further journey in physics you can keep saying teacher fast tha books books barabar nahi tha notes barabar nahi hai ye complicated hai time nahi mila college hai journal hai, practicals hai, ye sab bahane ab de sakte ho. You, you, you are welcome to give these explanations and excuses. But you must also remember and you must remember this that these excuses will not take you anywhere. The only way you can get through this is by having the concept so deeply embedded into you that you are able to answer any question, be it theory, be it MCQ, be it challenging, be it complicated, you are able to answer that. Once you get the concept, here's the next step. Make your notes and make it cute, make it nice, highlight it well, make it lucrative now here's number three after you make the notes have it handy with you and keep upgrading your notes on a regular basis your notes has to be the single most thing single most important thing that you are referring not book a book b book c no refer everything else for mcqs and questions but for solutions and answers come back to your notes because that's the place where you've made it now these notes can be from anywhere you make it but it has to be your notes and then what's important is to have the right set of mcqs to practice these practices in the right way to make sure that you begin with let's say 20 mcqs on a daily basis and keep going up every day even if you go up by one mcq every three days if you go up by two mcqs imagine in the next six months the amount of mcqs that you can solve the amount of practice that you can do i i am i'm really liking the fact that students are putting these questions to me on instagram on on youtube on Quora, etc but what i'm not understanding is these answers that i'm giving needs to be implemented it's it's pointless if you're listening to this and if you're not willing to implement work hard take the commitment and go ahead on it so here we are you may be just entering 11th standard you must be already in 12th you may be a dropper you may be a repeater doesn't matter if you're willing to take the concepts if you're willing to have the right set of notes if you're willing to practice minimum 20 mcqs to begin with and go to 30 go to 35 go to 40 and in, in, in the next six months you will reach a destination which you know you're happy to reach and you'll be able to solve there was a video which i just released which spoke about how to solve 20,000 mcqs or more in less than six months so all the best keep pouring in your love like share comment you can get in touch with me here on instagram or wherever you want to but make sure you follow your dreams make sure you chase your dreams make sure you become that what you really wanted to become because of which you've enrolled into science all the best at merit store we wish you well